Hey folks, Matt Edwards here with Vought RV, and I got the pleasure of showing you today the new 2021 Jayco 32 TSBH. And just so you know, TS means triple slide bunk house. This is a very large bunk house for the large families, okay? This trailer is 32 feet long, has an electric tongue jack that goes up and down with a light so that way it's easy to take care of. You've got the two large bottles up here, propane bottles, and you'll have a new battery right behind you there. Storage is pretty good on this SLX. You've got a pass-through storage right here that you can put plastic containers in with your stuff so that way you're able to see it, okay? That's also your grill right there, which I'll show you when we get toward the back, okay? If you'll notice up here too, all of Jayco's are plywood. You won't find any press wood in there. Aluminum framing, framing with wood to help with the structure of it. You've got one big super slide right out here. You've got the 15 inch Goodyear Endurance tires that are US made and come with a six year factory warranty on them. So you're covered for six years with your tires. Jayco also has a really neat feature. I'm sure you guys have seen tires have been blown out on the highway. And when that happens, that can really tear your trailer up. Jayco has metal reinforcement up here. If that was to happen, it'll help minimize the damage to your trailer. And you've also got beautiful mag wheels, I call them. Your cable inputs right up here. You have a ladder. You can go up on the roof on, the, on a Jayco, okay? Jayco's are built to withstand 4,500 pounds. Reason being, 30% of their inventory goes up north to Canada and up east where the snow comes down a lot. So it has to be able to, to withstand the weight of snow up there, okay? Also for us down here in Texas, if you're at a, you know, a pine forest or whatever and a tree falls on your trailer, you've got a little bit more protection on there for yourself, okay? Spare tire. This right here is the rack that you'll put your grill on, okay? And then right below here, you've got a propane gas quick connect. So that way you can connect it up there. You could even bring your own grill if you wanted to. Now, one of the safety features that a Jayco has is pretty cool. You'll notice up here, you see two lights, okay? That's not only your brake light, that's also your turn signal. Now, you've got a turn signal down below as normal, but when you go turn your turn signal on, that will flash and the whole side of the trailer will flash. That way, a guy that's two or three cars down can tell you're turning left or right, you can see it, okay? It's a really cool safety feature. Plus, you, it's wired for backup cameras too, okay? And that's a real neat feature because once you hook your camera up, you take the screen, which is Bluetooth, to your truck and you can just mount it on the dash. Super easy, okay? This has got a huge, nice outdoor kitchen. Two burner stove, you got a small sink out here. You've got cabinets and drawers to put all your outdoor grill in, grilling tools, food, beans, refrigerator out here. And notice everything's our vision our vision is a uh, company that builds refrigerators to be able to take the uh, the roads you've got a nice little cabinet back in here and just like with all jayco's everything is screwed into the wood no staples okay you have a two-year structural warranty with this unit uh, i put the big awning out all power this trailer's so cool, you can set the whole trailer up pretty much one-handed. Okay, and you've also got your lights up there that uh, aren't real bright and they don't track bugs. Okay, for your outside entertainment in here, you've got a power plug, your cable, and a TV mount. Jayco's really cool. Inside there, I'll show it to you, is a mount they give you, so that way you can get a small TV that you can either put in the bedroom and then move it out here, like for tailgating, watching movies at night, so forth. Um, it is thermal package. It's wrapped underneath. One thing I want to show you guys real quick is the new Moride steps over here. I think these are the coolest things, okay? They pop up right up in here for easy storage when you're driving down the road, okay? And when you get to your campground, pull your lever, pull it back down, and you've got a much more stable step system. Okay, let's go on inside. 
Now, I'm gonna turn this off, but all the ACs that bought orders are 15K ACs. We're in the state of Texas. It gets hot down here. So we make sure you've got plenty of air conditioning to keep you cool. Thermostats right here. It works just like your house. It's very simple and very easy to operate. So that's gonna go off here in just a second. When you walk in, you'll notice you have a really nice entertainment center right here, okay? Big screen antenna, big screen TV, excuse me, okay, that does twist around, move around, okay? So that way, if the family's in here, they can all watch a movie, and then when the kids go to bed, the parents can flip this around, and they've got a bit TV in their bedroom. It's a walk-around bed, okay? It is a queen. Um, your TV's right there, you can close your two doors. To me, most importantly, it has its own AC. In the bedrooms, we put a 13.5 and it shoots straight down in here. It gets nice and chilly in here when it's hot, okay? You've got your lights, your escape windows, your windows over here that you can open up for a nice breeze. A great little bedroom for mom and dad. Okay, along with your entertainment center, You've got the RV Technologies, AM, FM, CD player, and DVD player that ties into your TV. That way you can watch your favorite movies. Let me pull this back around real quick. If you've got girls, I really like that big window. Okay, over here you can put a DVD player, your box, your uh, whatever you want to add to your TV system. It plugs in real simple up there. Now down here, you've got an electric heater as well as a fireplace setting over here, okay? You can change the lights, you can bring them down, they change colors, but you can raise this right up here, your temperature that comes out here. So this is an electric heater. This is a pretty cool idea. What it does, it'll take the chill out of the room in the, on the cold mornings uh, without having to use your propane. And then turn it on and off is just real easy. You've got a remote control that goes with it. Okay, let's step over here to the galley. Now, as I mentioned to you earlier, all Jayco's are screwed in cabinet trees, okay? This cabinet, I can hang on that and pull on it and it's not gonna move, okay? If you see staples up there, run, because they fall apart. You gotta realize when you're going down the highway, there's a tornado going on in here. Everything's jumping up, down, and vibrating and moving. Solid wood construction. You've got the double sink right over here. Hot cold water, pot scrubber. That pulls out for extra room if you need it. And this is great to wash fruit or dishes. Let them dry right out there. Okay, you've got the three burner stove over here, which is the Furion. Okay, the high output and the low outputs are back here. Okay, your oven over here has a light on it. And it's also, you can also light this now from up here, okay? So when you go to your oven, you do a certain, you turn this a certain way and do that, and you can light the bottom in here instead of having to take the lighter down there like we used to have to do. Now something new that I'm really kind of excited about is the new refrigerators they're putting into them, okay? This is a 12 volt refrigerator. It runs only off electricity. But if you look at the size of it and the depth, for this trailer being able to accommodate 10 people, you can put some groceries in here. And it's like it's electric. Okay. Now how you're going to ask me how you am I going to keep that running? Okay. Your batteries will do it, of course, but also your trailer's wired with solar panels. A hundred watt solar panel up top will keep this running all the time for you. Okay. You've got your microwave. Got your fan. You got storage down here. Trash can storage right there. You've got all the drawers. Your keys are all key to like. Here's your remotes to your stereo, your fireplace, and your TV. Alrighty, let's move on this side over here. This side over here has the couch on it that you can turn around and watch TV. You can tilt it out. It also folds out to a bed, okay? Your dinette's the horseshoe dinette. This table is kind of cool because it's not on poles. You can actually move this table over here if you want to sit and watch TV on the couch, you can drop it down to make a bed to add more people to your trailer, okay? Now, here's the big thing about this trailer that I like the best, is the back part. 
There are so many different uses for this room. Now it's a bunkhouse, of course, and you've got one, two, three, four bunks in here. Each bunk will hold 300 pounds on the top. The double bunks hold 600 pounds. Now you can put four in here or you can put five. These down here switch to a bed. So you could put one, two, three, four, five people back here. A lot of folks, or some folks, are using these as offices too. They may not have the kids with them anymore, but they bring this back here and they use it for storage and for a you know office. Since everybody's working at home nowadays, because you can work on the road. So you got a table that pulls out for a nice little desk. You've got your cable hookup, your power hookup, and the TV mount that I showed you that goes on the outside, the bedroom, and back here. Now check this out. Tons of storage in drawers. At my house, that would be the boys, and this side over here would probably be the girls. I sold one of these trailers to some folks that are homeschooling their kids and traveling. And this is the trailer that they got. So they went up to Boston, Massachusetts up there to show them the history of America in the trailer and then would have their classes back here to learn what they learned, talk about what they learned. Okay, over here, you've got another huge cabinet that you could either store linens in or food. So let's count it up. You got one, two, three, four, five. You could put two on here, five, six, seven, two on the bed, eight, nine. Mom and dad's 11 people, if you're strong enough to put that many people in a trailer. Brave enough to put that many people in a trailer. Okay, bathroom. Now here's the cool part about that. Look at the vanity. My wife liked that vanity. That was some room she said she had up in there. You've got a small tub, if you have little bitty kids, and of course your shower in there. It's well ventilated, well lit with natural lighting. And you'll notice the toilet seat is porcelain. It's not plastic, it's not a cheapie. Jayco puts a little bit more money in their trailers, but for a lot nicer features and benefits for you guys. The consumer, benefits for the consumer. And if you're a tall guy, this is padded so you don't bump your head. Thanks for watching our video. If you guys have any questions, please email me at mEdwards at VotRV or call us anytime. We're open 9 to 6, Monday through Friday, 9 to 5 on Saturdays. Uh, be safe out there and God bless. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions, be sure to drop a comment below. Or if you have any suggestions on content you'd like to see, we'd love to hear about that. Go ahead and give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again from VotRV.